Welcome to this week's episode of Hump Day Romance. I'm your host, Zeus. Is it me or is there a new type of Negro emerging? This type of Negro is somebody that I see more and more popping up on the scene. He be getting hoes. I don't know how, but he be getting hoes. Ladies, y'all got to really explain to me, how is this nigga getting in y'all house? It's the type of dude that always finds himself arguing in women's business. And he got no type of business, even in the conversation. You know what I call him? Chatty chatty ass niggas. A lot of niggas don't realize that when they are too gossipy and too in the woman's business, it makes you look like very feminine to your woman. You feel what I'm saying? And sometimes when your man is always hanging out with your friends and he ain't got his own friends, you don't want to hurt his little feelings. In your heart of hearts, you really want to tell him, hey, babe, you need to float. Float on the way. You got to float about that thing. Now, ladies, y'all know exactly what I'm talking about. Some of y'all be bringing this dude to the party with you. He always say something wild or off, off putting, right? Off putting, no bill. And everybody looking at you like, why'd you bring this? Matter of fact, y'all might want to check the stay in your lane plan because it might go something like this. <laughs> I'm so weak. Hold on, you already know it's TD Tuesday. Where are the girls at? See, it's Tuesday, but it's overcast day, and my titties don't be glistening the same when the sun not all the way out. And so I just thought I'll take a, a break for Tuesday. Okay, so it's the shine for me. Absolutely. Uh, okay. Know, I see that y'all came out with the came out. Today. I mean, okay. Do we ever not? Well, I could cover mine. Those are clothes. You know. To, you know? Listen. Okay, listen. What happened today, Vaughn? You tell us about last oh, night. Oh my God, I wasn't gonna tell. Okay, so y'all know Davon. Yeah. Big hands Davon, big feet Davon. Oh, because okay. he got a big ego. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know, I wish there was I wish there was more big things, but yeah, it's, it's just about the ego. I know. <laughs> Isn't it crazy? It would be like the biggest dudes, like the most buff dudes, the, the big everything's yeah. big except that. I mean, like, it's kinda your fault. There's some whores in this house. There's some whores in this house. My baby's on the couch. Hey babe, what you doing here? Uh, you know, just hanging out, man. You know, saying come hang out and see everybody what y'all doing. You know, <laughs> you know this is a girls' meeting. You ain't supposed to be here. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Y'all need a male's perspective about how to get destroyed on a consistent basis. You see what I'm saying? You remember I had caught a Charlie Hart putting that dick on you all the way down. It was on my ankle right there, and it got swollen around there. I hit you across your eye with it, but babe, if you don't have titties, stay in your lane. All right, blue 42, flag on the play. Let's huddle up here. So everyone with titties, put your hands up. Everyone who doesn't have titties, get your ass out. You nigga. Ladies, as you will. Stay in your lane, agents. Always there when you need them. More of this story. Hey, fellas, let's just let the ladies have their time. You know what I mean? Let's just, you know, let's just mind our goddamn business. Trust me, you do not want to find yourself in the middle of a woman's conversation any goddamn way. Because contrary to popular belief, women are more cold and cutthroat than men can ever be. And that's the real deal, Holyfield, coming from Rope. And this message is sponsored by Hump Day Romance, Hump Day Romance, LLC. But remember, ladies, y'all got the power. You got the power between your legs. That's what I said. You stop cutting off these weak niggas, then it leaves room for these niggas. Y'all ain't ready for that. Y'all ain't ready. If you've enjoyed this episode of Hump Day Romance and you want to show a little love, then feel free to donate one dollar to the show. We appreciate all of you guys. Make sure you hit subscribe and make sure you hit that notification button. Feel free to share Hump Day Romance with your family and your friends. For anybody that you think the show might help, I'm Top Rope Zeus. Live your dreams, not your reality. Respect. Yeah, Diddy. And because the D stands for deep upside your head. Baby, remember I went all the way to the back of the throat. Did you tell them last time that me was on the ground? We had so much girth. You thought you could handle it, but I put them arm in your back. Babe, did you tell him what happened about the meat all the way on the floor inside the shoe? I caught a Charlie Hart kicking you. Man, I ain't never been eight this much in my life. You, you are, that is what she said. That, was a, that's a bad, that is what she is saying. That's the code over. That is what she has been. Who wants an hour and a half ahead? That sounds trash. Depends.
Smooth. If it's like the relaxing speed of like a massage, I'll be reading and doing work, but it can be done. I mean, I mean, if you want, you're, you're I'm not saying gonna, not a grown folks business. So you saying what? Many moments of breath, what about the meat? I don't have to come. Out of the air, you know what I'm saying? It's light living right there. You're in that coma life. You that not want to You got to be able to breathe. Right, got your nose. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ken, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Zeus, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, listen. I apologize.